All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Fate Apocrypha episode 18. Uh, in the last episode, we had some craziness ending off with the Jack the Ripper's master being killed. Uh, Jack the Ripper getting a whole two command spells shoved in her. Um, and then some freaky zombie shit, potential reality marble, marble shit going on. Um, so I'm just very excited to see what, what's going to happen in this episode. And yeah, as always, guys, I like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Ugh, hate the sound of like, oh, necks breaking and shit. I hate it. Just a bunch of kids. What is going on? Ooh, there she is. Is she back? No? Oh god, what is this? Is she dead? Don't go towards the light. Oh no! Oh, is this from when she was alive? Oh shit, I was not expecting an Atlanta uh, kind of flashback. Interesting. Oh, Artemis saved me and I lived. Wow. That looks like Casta from like Fate Zero and shit. Is it Fate Zero or maybe Fate Stay Night? No, it's Fate Stay Night. Oh shit, what is going on here? What, are the, what is this fucked up ability, bro? Are you good, see? What's wrong? Is this supposed to be Mini Jan? What the hell? Jesus Christ, dude. Bro, is some freaky nightmare shit. Ugh. Jesse, what the fuck are you talking about? The River Thames. Ra, wow. Well, it's different in old 19th century London. I like the spin of an idea that Jack the Ripper's getting his own little backstory right now. Yeah, this has to be a noble phantasm. Jan's in different clothing too. What the hell's going on? Yeah, this is what British people look like, not gonna lie. <laughs> oh god, what is this? You don't notice this shit? Oh, okay. Never mind. Seek, are you good? You've been in England for like half a day. <laughs> it ain't that bad. It's pretty bad. So she actually here? She's dead. But like... So this version of Jack the Ripper then is... What, multiple kids in one child? How does that make sense? I, I get what they're trying to say, but how does that make sense? Hmm. And now she's dead. She's so small. So very small. Is there that many kids inside of her? No fucking way. Everyone else looks like a child. She looks like an alien. Sorry. I think I live down here. Lady Angel. Yeah, she's gonna save you. I'll slice you up. That's how she's gonna save you. And put you out of your misery. Holy smite! Yeah, literally. Just give him the one too. Oh my god. You didn't say it like that, Jan. I'm about to see the Holy Maiden, Jan of Ark, fuck up some kids right now. <laughs> Wait, what? Why? Atlanta? Has she been corrupted? What is that shit on her arm? Yeah, but they've created the legend of Jack the Ripper, so... Get rid of him. This might be the end of Atlanta right now, honestly. 
she, she, this might be her episode to go along with Jack the Ripper. Oh, little flex. See, goddammit, can you put a plaster on it? Yeah, I was gonna say, that, that, that sounds like bullshit, bro. She'd be leading the charge. You led that battle, you created those bodies. Oh, holy maidens, but a holy fucks them up. Damn, I guess that's why she's always saying that she's not a holy maiden. She done some shit. I don't know. Someone up in heaven when we send their souls there. Mini, mini Joan of Arc. Say no. I'm here to save you. She puts her fist through her chest. Oh my god. No. Well, shit. This is about the, le the, mo the least obedient phantasm I've ever seen, but... Oh, okay, it does it in a nice way. It's not just... Not Jan just killing a bunch of kids. Mini Jan becomes... Big Jan? Oh, no. Becomes Jack the Ripper. Okay, makes sense. I can do math. Alante, you need to chill, bro. Oh, this is nice. We barely got any scream time for Jack the Ripper this season, but this is a nice way to send her off. Oh. Fuck, dude. I'm gonna tear up from this. Wow. Oof. Why did she say that? What does she mean by that? She, she really dropped that line and then left cold, bro. I don't believe it. Are you still possessed? What's wrong with you? Where is this bullshit on your arm come from? Who did this? Assassin's dead. No, they couldn't have. Bro, Atlanta's gonna die here. I don't believe it. Oh, Archer versus Archer. I swear, Kaidon is the only one with his head screwed on, honestly. She literally just said she's not a holy maiden. Who exactly is she possessed by? I don't get it. Well, these fucking dickheads smiling, bro. Wow. It's a very philo philosophical kind of approach to this uh, series about the difference between humans and servants and spirits and everything. Oh, God, Kainan, you, ru you ruined the goddamn situation, dude. Yeah, look at her. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you two alone for a little bit longer. Why, though? Like, you literally just return their souls to where they rightfully should be. Man, Jan has got a massive burden placed upon her. Yeah, bro, so am I. Like, got that mini Jan got dropped on her neck. Damn, y'all ain't see the fucking servants fight now here? At <laughs> the end of this episode looks like a finale of a season. From hell. Wow. Looks like we got something at the end of the CAA episode. Oh, Shakespeare, haven't seen you in a while. Oh boy, are you, preview are you previewing the next episode for me, Shakespeare? <laughs> Goddamn Shakespeare, man. Watch with a generous heart, Shakespeare says. Hmm. Interesting. I'm looking forward to seeing uh, what that could mean for the next couple episodes or not. Um, but yeah, that was episode 18 of Fate Apocrypha. Um, I really thought there was going to be more of a fighting, uh, more of a fight within this kind of noble phantasm reality marble-esque world. Um, but it was really cool. Uh, it was nice to see. Really interesting about Jack the Ripper being, from what it seems, fucking dozens of children um, in kind of one body. 
um, all the children that were kind of destroyed and ruined by that time period um, kind of lost to it really uh, and it would seem that their souls were trapped within Jack um, but now they have all been freed along with kind of the original Jack um, you know to to go on to the, the next stage of the eternity I suppose um, or whether or not there even is a Jack in this story and it's not just multiple children becoming that narrative that character i don't know uh really interesting concept of an episode and i really enjoyed it um a little bit some parts were like really creepy <laughs> but uh yeah it was really good um but yeah i want to thank you guys so much for watching i really enjoyed this episode and have an interesting day peace out guys